Well, let's go ahead and start recording because it's 11-11. <clears throat> on 11-11. I'm cleaning up this previous pre-reading here. I should probably have left it on the table and just built over it, but you know. Eh. <laughs> it wouldn't be pretty. And I'll be confused and be like, what's what? No, no, no. Um, yeah, go back and watch the previous readings. <laughs> Completion: ten wands, ten pen, uh, cups. Passionate new beginning. Chariot, and I see judgment, temperance, and the sun. Wow, could you, could you try to get the calm waters and not be up all night, pacing the room, stressing out. Assessing <clears throat> mm -hmm. a street <laughs> hierophant. That's not the hierophant. It might as well be. Two of Cups, Strength card, Queen of Pentacles, Nurturance, and two. Uh, six Wands, Upside Down, Clutching Energy, Letting It Go, Fuck It, Truth been juggling this too long stealing my own happiness leaving me in despair uh, I know what I want to commit to and that illuminates my world but uh, I'm thinking about it too much so I'm just kind of stuck in my head but I gotta go or I'm gonna get a tower I, I just I know it but I fear what the tower is or I, and I fear the empress oh no I don't know what to do ah <laughs> emperor and judgment, yeah. Well, you see, you're going to get disappointed if you don't look to new horizons and put down the fakeness and embrace the bold and beautiful and have resolve. Your world is on the line, and so is realness. Lovers, walk away from that player in, her, in and out energy put a red flag on it and grab that new ace of wands <clears throat> new ace of wands and go share your cup talk about everything that you've been pushing down open up there's steve's pre-reading right there and instead of eight pentacles it's the will of fortune filled by a king that knows the truth the truth about their happiness and they can't just sit back and watch anymore. <clears throat> wow. <Well. clears throat> wow. Well. Illusions. Star energy. Destiny on top here. Interesting. Um, it's interesting because the Leo angle for his Friday read was the star. The star's trying to get independent, free. Wants to come face the truth and apologize. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Give that cup a little. <laughs> to get 10 cups. Uh, judgment. Because you've been stealing it away. Stealing what away? Your soul connection of two cups with the high priestess for what? Some knight of wands. Get balanced in your life. Stop listening to others. Fuck it. <laughs> know what to stand for. Defensiveness. Walk away from and walk towards. Get your victory. Chariot and strength card into happiness of the sun. Mm. Can't make that shit up. Despair on the bottom. Ace of Cups and self defeated. Little student. Wanting to go to the Empress though. There's a monkey on their shoulders. Making them be faking pretense. Oh, I can't, I can't go do that. I, it would, it would make me a liar about everything else I've said. King of Wands. Down 
talking about, right? <clears throat> Full energy leaps out about facing the truth. Queen of Swords. What are these two? Full leaps out about their will of fortune. It's going to be stuck, overburdened through a whole cycle. You're going to start a cycle in ten swords and ten wands because you just wouldn't look at what your intuition is screaming at you to get balanced. Mm -mm -mm. The Empress. It's divine timing. Leap in. Get that victory. Mm. Ace of Cups on the bottom. Put that there. Got the sad horse. Into the eight pointed mm, rainbow antlered buck deer there. Crossed by. Mm. Fear of missing out. With a, a wall so tall, you need the stairs to get over it. Brought to you by the moon in disappointment. There's that Ace of Wands, though. But you gotta be bringing that truth. See that Ace of Wands up there? Holding on to it in the dark, waiting for it to explode. Show the path forward to that intuitive high priestess or a knight of wands I don't know you choose your victory little doe hope you learned how to forge little doe is stuck in their head though overthinking it clutching to the truth about not wanting to face it if I just stay here and not don't spread my wings um um, I don't have to look at this. Uh, you can't, you, the chrysalis is gone. You, you can't stay in there any little more, any more little caterpillar, caterpillar, <laughs> Cater, caterpillar, <laughs> caterpillar. There we go. Oh, you don't want to come down and off that tree? Lightning bolt. Oh, shit. Upgraded. Eight swords, nine swords. Ah. Uh, Oh, the heartache. Oh, it's so horrible. But my happiness. I could be happy. I could, but it's just... Oh, it's better if I just leave it in the dream. Because I'll just fuck it up. Maybe you won't. Maybe you wouldn't fuck it up. Huh. Never noticed this about the ten cups here. Each of these have a single color in them. But they pour into mixing and the opposite cups. One one color for each cup. Blue, green, yellow, orange, red. Into each of these cups. Because mm. you're independent. You're free. Freedom. Or are you not? A free person wouldn't be in that energy, would they? Truth. So now all you have is where we started. A sad horse. Five cups of despair. And just waiting for another opportunity while you just Pray for a miracle. A sweat beats down off of your thoughts. This is the the tears of anxiety from the Nine of Swords. Not opening up about how one feels about real and go getting the most solid, reliable new beginning. Dissolve those illusions as the sun fills that one cup. Instead of it being in its normal position. Where the happiness is poured out. And all the secrets fill these cups. Truth, illumination, the sun. Points out all the fake and illusions. 
Why? Because cups illuminate. Cups are real. Divine timing. To get what? Victory? I see a very similar card there. Crown chakra. Heart chakra. Hmm. Third eye. I didn't mean to pick those up, but it led right to judgment. Led right to judgment. Facing the truth, wanting to apologize, getting independent, going for that. <sighs> slowest energy in the deck, but it's the slowest because it's the most stable. To pull you up out of disappointment. Get a mermaid back in the water. The divine... God themselves energy there. Trying to show the way. Fake or real. It's your happiness that you're stealing away. That Ten of Cups energy again. Just keep it in the dream. If I keep it in the dream, I don't have to face all this temperance energy. Must be rolling into Sagittarius season as we hold the line, resolve, and step into this new world. Cups and lovers. Hmm. The intro, 12 minutes, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11, 11. <laughs> uh, well, it's solid foundation. It's a lot of energy here. So, Step into a reading. Oh, we well, didn't do all that. <clears throat> Tower, justice, miracle for the emperor to get to calm waters. To come and bring in that one truth. Open up the three cups. Apologize, page of cups. But they have to make a decision about someone in their past. Six cups, two swords, six cups. They need a miracle worker, Forneas, into the fuck it energy of four pentacles. The light bringer, morning star, devil energy, Lucifer. Astri with the king of pentacles there. King, stability, into a queen of stability. Divine couple there. If they don't do that, sad horse energy. How about that solid, stable beginning? They've been juggling. Temperance, Sagittarius energy. It's just going to leave someone in nine swords. Nine swords. Underneath nine swords, two cups. So... Three wands, that new horizon. And if you stay in the nine swords, unlooking at the angel energy, it leads to three swords. Heartache. And to the king of truth, the king of swords. Then we have the same uh, reading already here. So coming in quickly. So I wanted to talk about the feelings they've been holding back. The King of Cups. That Four of Wands stable foundation energy. But one's just in eight swords. That um, butterfly uh, ready to spread its wings but trying to still stay in a chrysalis that's no longer there anymore. Stealing away their happiness over where's the bear over the three swords of heartache judgment which will end with actually no because there's more under it the ten cups just keep it in the dream you can't keep destiny inside of a dream you can't keep a wish 
a manifestation inside just a dream. Especially when it's sitting there knocking on your door for victory to get that wheel of fortune moving. Truth. So if this energy is ignored, it just creates disappointment and a wall. And someone who's may not be hermit as far as socializing, but a hermit with their feelings. Immature energy. And they'll just have to work at it again from the beginning. Hope that they get another Queen of Cups opportunity. It's not every day you encounter somebody that gives the full cup. A true lover. This moon energy. And this, the decision of two wands. With a fool. Illusions. Overburdened. About this new cycle. This new world. Whilst they have a changed perspective. Once your paradigm is shift, you can't go back to the old one. It would be an illusion. You've walked away from it, and now you have to walk towards. <clears throat> Collaborating and bringing in a cup of real in order to get happiness. But you self-defeat all the time putting an end to how you feel about something, thinking it'll die and change. But the Sesame Street Hierophant says, watch and see that Empress and their beauty. When all you made up was an excuse and you still just wanted to bang them. But I was free and independent. I'm an, I changed everything. So I could face the truth. Yeah, look at them facing it, you know. <laughs> About what? That big giant cup of real. Four swords. Nothing's happening. And then something will happen. Those two of cups. To go get that wish fulfillment. With the high priestess. Into the ten pentacles that dream steps out of the dream world it becomes real something we're standing and fighting for and something that isn't fake ego and pride but turns into passion unbridled something that when they say their word their word means something the knight of pentacles says it's gonna do it it's gonna do it they may be late as fuck but they're going to get there. They're slow energy, but they're reliable. It's divine timing. Fear of missing out. What? That night of wands? Take strength and courage. You cannot have an empress, wherever she may be. And be fearful. Tao. <clears throat> I'm glad I went through that. So it wasn't. <laughs> I was like, oh, I'll go through it later. Yeah, no. Energies right here, right now. Talk about it right here, right now. It's the energetic new year. Happy new year, everybody. Happy new year. What does this new year bring us? The most stable, nurturing queen in the deck. It's gonna help pull that sad horse's head up. With a shiny pinnacle. There you go. Look, you like things. That makes you happy, right? Things make you happy, right? Yeah. It's not the light that shines. 
in your darkness. So come in and tell your truth. Open up. Hmm. Eh, yeah, what mind? <laughs> on the page ones. I like that. Curiosity. Curiosity about what? Now look at that. As you see, I don't keep my cards upside down. When one pops up upside down, that's important to me. Two of swords upside down is a decision is made. That's been the most important thing the whole time. Just actually make a decision. Passion cups. Passion cups. <clears throat> Herman energy. Solid, stable. New beginning underneath there. A rebirth from walking away from manipulations. Thievery. Into that king of truth. King of solid word. His word means so much to him. He's up all night on the toilet pacing. Wondering, thinking about it, thinking. Don't think, embrace destiny. Take, take your hands off the reins and let the flow happen. It'll get you to that dream manifest fearlessly. And get that wish fulfilled with an empress. Because why? You opened up your cup and brought it swiftly. Eight wands. How you see things differently. And it'll get your heart, mind, and soul finally into calm waters. Why? Because you embrace the king of truth. Justice. Libra energy. Curiosity. Mm -hmm. Curiosity. Boom, 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 boom. Knights and pages. We queens and kings. They bring the solidity there. Hmm. Well, that's been an interesting little powwow, shuffle, clean up. I miss doing those. Those were fun. Judgment. I would, um, Sesame Street, Hierophant in there. About your Ten of Cups, your destiny, your balance and justice, about real. <laughs> Got little Muppets singing songs to you, making it easy. <laughs> it was a great, great descriptor. Uh, of the energy there, Steve. Hands down, because here it is. I see it. The heartache is made simple to understand about the choice of lovers, of the empress, an angel, happiness. All you gotta do is dive in. Come in quickly, emperor. Maybe they can help you get to eight, uh, the eight pentacles to nine easier. Because, well... They got intuition, and they can teach you as well, too. Mm. Pull your head out of that disappointment. <clears throat> um, Destiny. Ace of Cups. bottom of the deck. Lovers crossing the full. New Horizons. There's your three card summation there. 1111 uh, portal at 1111. And we'll leave it at that. I'm sure I'm at like 20, yeah, 25 minutes. Mm. Yep. There's the energy there. 
leap of faith and a choice about a love connection. What's feeling that? Judgment. And the Ace of Cups is red with new horizons. Burying the two choices of old and grabbing that Ace of Wands there. Looking towards the happiness of your son. Throw some clarifiers on this. Let's clarify this. Um, let's put this up here. Let's clarify this uh, Ace of Cups here for me. The Miracle. Resolve. King of Wands underneath that. Yeah, let's um, put that in the center there as I saw Illusions of Seven Cups. The Devil. Fear. Fear about why this is important to you. Happiness. The sun banishes all fear. And so does truth. Similar energy. For color match, Sesame Street wise. Truth will vanish or banish the devil to get what? What is that big bright orb there? Happiness. Are you happy on a nice sunny day when you're outside and you ain't got worries in your head? And you're filled with realness? Mm-hmm. I, I, I know I am. There you go. Sesame Street. <laughs> purple, purple. Truth, fear, happiness, real. Happiness is red with real. Devil is red with king of truth. <laughs> That's what gives you resolve. Purple sun, purple sun. For who? Burger King, king of wands. Who's got their head in the corner? Butterfly trying to pick your head up so you can bring in the truth. Our time was for you. Why? Because you're fearful. Fearful about what? Two cups. And the victory and the nourishment that it brings. I suggest listening to that little dragon there and say, fuck it. Grab that sword of truth. Mm. Ten swords. Let's clarify this, um... New Horizon. That's three cards want to slide out. Oh. Um, there's that resolve again. And bottom of the deck. Eight Pentacles. Resolve. Come in passionately. Man on a mission. Get the calm waters. Got the color matches here. Look at that. Purple, purple, light of truth, the light of your resolve, which is happy. Your fears, anxieties, fears, anxieties. What gets rid of those fears, anxieties? That sort of truth. <laughs> and all the green of opening up your heart chakra and being real gets you to ten pinnacles. Mm hmm. Destiny. Look at that. Destiny. There's, there's two clarifiers there. Being beautiful. Fool. Why are you here? The moon? Moon energy? All right. It's saying stop right here. Five pentacles on the bottom. And it says grab these cards. Listening to others is keeping from making that leap of faith. Thinking that you still have mm, to get to the, your independence in order to... These people are convincing you that you're still stuck. And you need that other pentacle to get independent. I want to throw one more. Yeah, see? See that you already have it. That's the secret here at the bottom of the deck. Which was opening up to get your will turning. Embracing your intuition. What did I say about that earlier? With the, the, the web there? Will pull you out of your head. 
you're overthinking it and give you the miracle to let go of the control. Well, as I always said about this card, and to ride in with that golden heart. Or you can just, you know, cut your nose off to spite your face again. <clears throat> mm -hmm. So, moon and three cups. What was this resolve over here? I can't pull that then. And what was crossing here? Y'all remember? I left that. Look at that. Mm. Emperor, Empress, and the Magician in between. The Manipulator. It's three-party energy if I've ever seen it. <laughs> um, give me one more on the uh, Ten Pentacles and the star up there crossing the star. Chariot. Mars, self-defeated. Empress. There's your reading. <laughs> Actually, I'm going to grab the uh, original deck here. And since we expanded on those, we'll expand on those because we got judgment. Oh shit, there it is. And judgment and justice about the heartache. Truth. Reconciliation energy. What is this? Oh, look at that happiness again. Not that where did we see that card before? Look at that happiness. Judgment on the bottom. I'm gonna grab from the top. Got to make a choice. Judgment day. You want that balance and justice? Truth. The illumination and realness of the sun. Turn that choice into no choice. Grab that ace of cups here. Give me one card and a crosser. One card and a crosser. What what applies to this energy here? What what could help? Knowing what to stand for. What would you stand up and fight for? It'll pull you out of your head and worry. And get you to those deep roots. Someone who's real, nostalgic, someone from your past. Eh, it's, might as well be three cards. Ten cups. <laughs> that dream. And because I saw it, I'll show you. Or you could self sabotage it again. What would you fight for? There's your reading. So. Happy Energetic New Year, everyone, and I'm going to pull another reading, but I figure I should stop this one here, because we're at 34, or 33, 33, actually. So, threes are important. So, if you're in a dark space, Q's got you.